In a previous episode, we realised that there were two types of tow bars. There's class one and class two. Now class one is generally identified by the fact that it's got a bolt-on tongue and is usually used for towing lighter weight trailers and RVs. Class two tow bars are a heavy duty version. It has more fixing points and spreads the load over the vehicle in a larger area. Class two tow bars allow for the maximum towing capacity of the vehicle. What the class two bar also does is allow for the fitment of a weight distribution hitch. What that does is take some of the weight off the front of the van and transfer it to the front of the car and levels everything up. Pretty easy to fit, so let's just do it. Okay, first a little tip. Put your jockey wheel in, wind him up, try and get the A-frame up at around about the level height of the back of the car. Your bars start off parallel with the back of the car, into the eyelet, into the sleeve, and then bring your chain around so that one of the eyelets is going to go up over the hook onto your lifter, take a bit of the strain up, and then with your bar to give you more leverage, the handle brings it up, the, the pin will go in from the front, not from the back, and slides through, and then take your handle away. We're going to take the jockey wheel out and do the other side. Okay, so jockey wheel comes out, place him to the side, we'll just put the clamp back in, make sure it's nice and secure. The wheel has to come off because this bar won't fit in while the wheel's in place. And then we repeat the process. Parallel with the car with the bar, eyelets in, get our chain up to the right level, over to the hook, place it in position, use our leverage bar to close it up, our pin simply goes in again from the front, locks into position, take the bar away. How easy is that? Look at what we've created here. A beautiful balanced motoring package with some simple equipment. Just a couple of small things. Don't buy D-shackles unless they've got the weight rating stamped on them. Oh, one small thing, a lot of people seem to think that if you've only got one chain, you've got problems. That's quite legal, so don't worry about that. I guess the overall message is you've got such an enormous investment here and an enormous investment here, why try and scrimp and save money? Happy motoring.